Gentlemen, 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 we have a problem. I guarantee that you have lower testosterone levels than your great grandfather when he was your age. I, I guarantee it. And I'm not even talking crap, it's just the honest truth. According to new research, the average 22 year old man today has the testosterone levels that a 65 year old man had just 20 years ago. We are literally in a testosterone epidemic. As a society, men's testosterone levels are getting lower and lower every single year. And it's a massive problem because testosterone provides so many different benefits for men. And it's scary because I would love to say that it's getting better and that there's signs that it's going to improve. But every single thing that we're doing as a society is only pointing towards testosterone levels continuing to drop. And as a man, you need to realize that testosterone is not just important for alpha males. It helps you to fight stress. It helps you to increase your muscle mass. It helps you to have better memory and better focus. It literally changes your pheromones and makes you more attractive to females. It makes you more ambitious and more dominant. No matter what your goals are in life, as a man, having optimal high levels of testosterone is one of the best things you can do to maximize your performance in every single area of your life. And the thing about it is that this is not just a problem for men, it's not. Ladies, you do not want a man who has no drive. You don't want a man who is weak. You don't want a man who needs porn to get hard. You don't want a man who can't take care of the family. You need a man who is strong and driven and confident within himself. And those all come with high optimal levels of testosterone. This is not a man problem. It's a society wide problem. It's going to impact all of us. This is something that needs to be addressed. Low testosterone is a problem that destroys men and women. So in this video, I am going to explain how to optimize your testosterone levels completely naturally. No drugs, no substances, no nothing, completely natural. So before we get into anything, I just want to explain how this video is organized. And you've probably already watched many different testosterone increasing videos in the past. But the purpose of this video is to focus only on the core foundational habits. In other words, I only am going to talk about the things that have been scientifically proven to have massive increases and massive impacts on your testosterone levels. So if something only causes a slight increase to your testosterone levels, then it's not going to be in this video. So if you don't want to waste time doing a million different things and hoping that one of them will work, this is the video for you and all of the scientific research is attached down below in the description. But anyways, let's get right on into it. Number one, one of the best things you can do in order to increase your testosterone sustainably is to ensure that you always get enough sleep. But the question is, what do we define enough sleep as? Because that could mean one thing to one person and something completely different to everyone else in this current day and age. So what is enough sleep? So according to a study from the University of Chicago, they had a group of 10 men with an average age of 24 years old do an entire week where they only got five hours of sleep every night. And at the end of that week, they took another sample of those men's testosterone levels. And on average, they saw a 10 to 15% decrease in their testosterone levels after just one single week of getting five hours of sleep every night. And again, this is only from one week of bad sleep. So think of how this can compound and get worse and worse over time. And it doesn't just stop there. It's not only about the quantity of sleep you get, it's also about the quality of sleep you get. So if you're on your phone right before you go to sleep, that also decreases your quality of sleep and that decreases your testosterone levels. So for this, what you need to be sure to do is try to turn off your phone at least an hour before you go to sleep and make sure to get at least, at least 
seven hours of sleep a night. That will optimize your testosterone levels over the long haul. Within a week, you will see a massive difference. Number two, make sure you get enough sunlight and enough vitamin D. Scientific studies have shown that getting enough sunlight has a massive impact on our testosterone levels. But getting enough sunlight goes way beyond just improving our testosterone levels. It also helps us to have a better mood and it also even impacts our sperm count. So whether you're just trying to increase your testosterone or also trying to be a happier person overall, getting enough sunlight is one of the key things you can do to help in that area. Also remember that when you are out in the sun getting vitamin D and trying to up your testosterone levels, you want to have as much skin exposed to the sun as possible. So that means ditch as many of your clothes as possible. Now, don't get arrested by the police. That's not what I'm saying but you want to be sure to maximize your skin exposure. But be sure to spend at least 30 minutes a day outside in the sun, sucking up them rays. What Pause. Did you say? Number three, weightlifting. Weightlifting is one of the best ways to increase your testosterone over the long haul. It has a massive impact on your levels. According to a 1981 study, men saw a 21.6% average increase in their T levels after weightlifting. That is massive. And something that a lot of guys don't realize that I need to mention here is that when you do extreme endurance style exercises like marathons and super long jogs, that actually decreases your testosterone levels. So if increasing your testosterone levels is one of your main goals, and it should be, then you need to focus on weight lifting exercises and not just endurance style exercises. When you are exercising, you want to focus specifically on compound movements. And compound movements are essentially any exercises that work multiple muscle groups at the same time. So that's your deadlift, your bench press, your squat. Any exercise that targets multiple muscle groups at the same time, that's gonna have the most bang for your buck in terms of increasing your testosterone levels. So if you want to increase your T levels, weightlifting is one of the best things that you can do. Number four, and this is gonna be a tough one for a lot of you guys, I already know. It's twofold. You want to, first of all, remove porn, but secondly, increase your sex with real women. Now, according to new studies, which I linked in the description, when men took a week away from masturbation, they saw an average increase of 145% in their T levels. 145% after just one week. But it's not all bad news. Although masturbating has been shown to decrease testosterone levels, having sex with a real partner has been shown to up your levels. So according to a different study, men who had sex with a real partner were shown to have a 72% increase in their testosterone levels on average after finishing sex. So if you cut out masturbation and have sex with a real partner as well, then you're winning on both ends. Number five, eat real foods. Now, I don't need to attach any science or research or studies for this one because it's so obvious. If you put fake food in your body that's made in a factory or man-made, that is going to impact your testosterone levels. We are not designed to eat those foods. Eat real meat, real plants, real vegetables, real food from the earth. Anything else will infect your internal biome. If you put trash into your body, you are going to get trash out. It's that simple. But anyways, those are the five core principles you need to keep in mind as you are trying to optimize your testosterone levels. I promise you, if you do those five things for 30 days consistently, you will feel different. You will. You're going to feel like a new man. And if you're like me and you want to see every video on a topic before doing anything, trust me, don't do that here. You have all of the information you need in order to increase your testosterone levels. These are the core principle habits. 
So focus on actually going out to apply them. Do them for 30 days and I promise you will feel like a new man. Your life will change. After you actually put these five habits into action for 30 days, you are going to feel more manly, more focused, less stressed, more masculine, more alive. You can do this. I know you can. Don't waste your life in constant search of more information. You have it right now. Please go apply. You got this. I know you do. And also, if any of you are trying to figure out if you have low testosterone levels, go watch my last video right here.